SmartLine Programming. Before we learn how to program your SmartLine controller, let's take a moment to familiarize ourselves with the front panel controls. The heart of the controller is the program dial, which provides access to all setup and programming features. Watering days in the current week and has an icon to show strength of the backup 9 volt battery in your controller. If you have the SLW weather monitor attached, you can check the 9 volt battery in the weather monitor by turning the dial to any auto adjust position. During a watering cycle, the display will show the active program, the zone number, and a countdown in hours minutes and seconds until the watering for that zone is completed. The program button allows you to view schedules for programs A, B, C, and D. You will also need to use this button to select a program when you are entering schedules on the right hand side of the programming dial. The idle screen will always show program A when the controller is in the run position. The next back and up down arrow keys allow you to set up and adjust your controller. The sensor button is used to bypass sensors attached to your system. When the active LED is lit, your rain and freeze sensors can automatically pause watering operations to prevent water waste and hazardous icing conditions on sidewalks and streets. The active LED will turn red until the sensors allow watering to resume. If you have an SLW weather monitor connected to your system, the LED will turn from red to orange for an additional 48 hours to allow for further drying of the soil. The mode button is used to select standard or auto adjust watering. The SLW weather monitor must be installed and communicating with your controller before the mode button can be placed in the auto adjust position. When the weather monitor is connected and communicating, you will see an antenna icon in the display. A simplified programming guide is provided on the inside door of your SmartLine controller. This guide provides a handy reference for making changes to your watering schedule. Now let's get started with your SmartLine controller. You will notice that the programming dial is laid out in a logical clockwise sequence. For automatic watering, always leave the controller in the run position. The mode LED displays green when the dial is set to the run position. You can use the system off position on the dial when you want to cancel all automatic watering for a period of time. The smart line will continue to keep the correct time and will retain all programs. This function only interrupts power supply to the valves. When the dial is set to the off position, the mode LED will display red. Auto adjust positions on the dial are only used when you have the SLW weather monitor attached. We'll talk about auto adjust in the auto adjust programming section.